big bunch of people. Thank, Thank you, sir. Happy birthday from Smuckers. That's not far from Orville. You know where our Orville is where they do those little magical tricks with all kinds of jams and berries. Helen Taylor, Glenn Gardner, New Jersey, 105, loves chocolate. Passionate square dancer. Woo! For many, many years, attributes her longevity to never smoking or drinking. How about that? Hallelujah. Okay, Emmanuel Manny Hubble, as he's known to his friends. Fort Lauderdale, Florida, is 105, lives independently, goes dancing twice a week with his, get this, lady friends. Not just one, he shares the wealth. Known as the Energizer Bunny. I gotta talk to him. <laughs> he can probably help me. Ida Flavel, Brooklyn, New York, 104, retired sewing machine operator. That was a big business for women back before, you know, they did a lot of work with the sewing machines many, many years ago. Secret to longevity, faith in the good Lord, and being thankful for singer. How about that? You can't go wrong. Nora Bond, Roanoke, one of my favorites. What a pretty look. Look at that face. Beautiful. She's from Roanoke, Virginia. It's a great town, by the way. 102 years old, loves talking with people, telling hilarious jokes, enjoys going out to eat, makes the best sweet potato pie in the world. A real art. If you like sweet potato pie, that is an art. Nino Bellini, <laughs> my shoes of Bellino, molto bene. And he's from Feeding Hills, Massachusetts, 100 years old, immigrated from Italy to the United States, age nine. Lives independently, goes fishing, and has a daily glass of wine with his family and friends. And finally, we have Roque Ramos of San Bernardino, California. 100 years old today, lives on his own, cooks and cleans the house. Played golf until he was 90, probably shot his age. Known for his smile and his sense of humor. Hey, you're a good-looking man. Matt is a good-looking man. He's a new, he'll be 110, one of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, very soon, Willard. Thank you very much.